Okay, E, the Pro Bowl roster came out. Did you know that? No, I didn't know that. Well, the roster did come out, and apparently there are no New Orleans Saints players on the Pro Bowl roster. Now, this almost happened last year, but Cam Jordan became an alternate in, in the Pro Bowl, so the Saints were able to have at least one player. But for the second year in a row, when the Pro Bowl roster was being made, no New Orleans Saints players made the roster. Are you shocked by that? Yeah. Uh, basically, I think that uh, Drew Brees is supposed to make a Pro Bowl pretty much almost every year, almost. I yeah. mean, if you just look by the stats. Eh, but absolutely. I'm sure they wasn't. I'm sure they wasn't just looking by the stats. They was looking by numbers. They looking by basically the market of the team. I guarantee you that the Cowboys got more than seven or eight Pro Bowls. I guarantee you the Giants got more than six or seven Pro Bowls. You're right. I guarantee you the Seattle got more than six. Mm-hmm. I guarantee you the Packers probably got more than four or mm-hmm. five. Mm-hmm. So it, it goes by it goes by your market. I mean, it goes by the name of the actual player. I guarantee you the Patriots probably got ten. So that's that's basically what it goes by. Unfortunately, the Saints don't play in a big market. Yeah. Anything somebody, any, anything you know about the Saints begins and ends with Drew Brees. Right. You're not talking about Brandon Cooks could have made the Pro Bowl. I think he got two games remaining. He's over a thousand yards. Mm-hmm. You got Michael Thomas, who probably could have been an alternate. They will have alternates, so the Saints probably will have Drew Brees in the Pro Bowl, depending on what happens with the three quarterbacks. But yeah, it it is surprising. I think Drew Brees probably he's probably on pace for another forty eight, forty five. I mean, forty nine thousand uh, hundred yard uh, passing yard uh, yard a season again. Mm-hmm. So, uh, I mean, you could just pencil Drew Brees in for a Pro Bowl every year, but for some reason they don't feel the need to pencil him in. I think he had a a better season than Aaron Rodgers. Uh, I mean, nobody's having a better season than Dak Prescott, though. I mean, he, he should yeah. be. He yeah, should be starting right yeah. about now. Yeah. Well, I think that the fact that no New Orleans Saints player made the Pro Bowl roster is an absolute outrage, man. Are you kidding me? No New Orleans Saints player made the Pro Bowl roster? Come on, man. Like you said before, I'm going to say it, okay? The Pro Bowl is nothing but a popularity contest. That's all it is. That's all it is. If you play in a big market, you're going to have more Pro Bowlers because people can see your players early and often. You know, they see them every single week. They have the 3 o'clock game. They got the America game of the week. They got primetime. They got Monday Night Football. They got all of these outlets. And if you play in a small market, then you already have a strike against you. The fact that Drew Brees... Didn't get a Pro Bowl bid is an outrage. 4,559 yards, 34 touchdowns, 14 interceptions. Drew Brees deserves to be in the Pro Bowl. Let me tell you why he deserves to be in the Pro Bowl. Drew Brees for two weeks threw zero touchdowns, six interceptions, and still maintained a 71% pass completion. That is unbelievable. This guy has two of the worst games in his entire career, and he still maintained over 71% completion of his passes. This guy deserves to be in a Pro Bowl. You can even make an argument for Cam Jordan. Sure, Cam Jordan doesn't have the sexy stats. He he doesn't have double-digit sacks. He has six and a half sacks this season. But the fact of how he has performed in run support and setting the edge and hurrying the quarterback – Cam Jordan deserves to be in a Pro Bowl. And not to mention Kenny Vaccaro, which I feel like he should at least get opportunity to play in a Pro Bowl. But I, I'll go ahead and I'll uh, go ahead and um, renege on that um, particular t- uh, topic because he's serving a four-game suspension. But when it comes to Drew Brees, when it comes to Cam Jordan, and I can make an argument for Michael Thomas, these are three players that I feel like should have made the Pro Bowl, but it is an outrage. This is a bias. This this is a biased voting. Okay, that's all it is. If you play in a big market, they're gonna love you. If you play in a small market, nobody knows about you. You playing in the twelve o'clock games. You're playing in the games that they feel like nobody wants to see. That's the reason, like you said, the Dallas Cowboys get more votes. The New York Giants get more votes. The Pittsburgh Steelers get more votes. The the Philadelphia Eagles get more votes. This is bias, okay? And the fact that... 
I'm sorry. And the fact that Drew Brees, Cam Jordan, and Michael Thomas didn't get a bid to the Pro Bowl, I mean, it's an absolute outrage. 